Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. If you guys have a BMW 3 or 4 series, guys, today's video will be super helpful and we will explain where the exhaust vanus actuator solenoid is located on that BMW, guys. Now, that will include many different, uh, different BMWs. Some of them will be 320, 328, 420, 428, guys, and it may work on the 316s, 318s, and 418 as well. Quick introduction now guys, every single car we get at the shop guys, including this one here, we make more than 200 videos. On this one specifically, we'll have close to 300-400 videos. Why we guys do all that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return guys, please subscribe to the channel and like the video so we can keep making those free videos and uh, deliver them to you guys. If you need to buy replacement parts, Vanus Solenoid, uh, any tools guys for your BMW, we have the link in the description of the video below for your convenience, so please guys check it out. All that will be shared there. This is a 328i that we'll demonstrate on, but as I said, multiple models will be that way. And even guys, if you have the six cylinder engine, okay, I think it will work as well, guys. Even if it's not the four cylinder. So this is it right here, four cylinder engine, guys. Now, uh, let me guys start, okay, by saying something. If you guys want to see the whole replacement video we have it on our main channel auto repair guys auto repair guys check it out guys this is our main channel uh, now if you want to see electrical videos engine codes diagnosing electrical components on this bmw we will guys share them on our third channel electrical car repair life check that one there guys and this is a failed timing chain out of this engine guys uh, that uh, has only 87,000 miles this kind of engine n20 engine guys the whole video for timing chain replacement it's on our main channel auto repair guys if you have a bmw like that you need to guys check it out otherwise you can say bye bye to your engine guys and spend quite a bit on repairs now you guys need to remove the engine cover you guys have three mounts one two three right here you need to go ahead pull up okay and then once you disconnect all three of them you have two guides on the back so you lift it up slide it out okay just like that and let me show you where the mounts are located actually okay right here one two three and let me show you where they attach to the engine so you know what to look for guys now this is it one mount okay two and number three right here so i'll go ahead pull that foam piece out and let me explain now okay now let me explain where that exhaust vanus actuator solenoid is located looking at the car this is the intake side intake manifold throttle body right here uh, and this is guys the intake camshaft on the other side we have the exhaust so the exhaust camshaft will be on this side of the engine this is the exhaust camshaft and this is the uh, vanus intake solenoid guys right here this device you have one uh, more sensor on the bottom okay right here this is the camshaft position sensor but this right here guys okay this is the vanus solenoid if you want to see the replacement video on the channel we have it on auto repair guys check it out uh, you need some special tools okay like this one female torque socket guys we we'll have those listed in the description of the video below but pretty much guys that's it so hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you trying to do that thank you for watching please subscribe to the channel for more help and see you guys next time